Hello you guys, how are you today? Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if it's your first time here. My name is Sunny. In this channel, we love all kinds of DIYs, knitting, it's my new hobby now, crocheting, sewing, everything, macrame. I haven't done any macrame videos now that I think about it. Maybe I should do one. And we also love thrifting. And today is one of those videos where we go to Savers and we thrift. This week we are having a lovely weather here in Melbourne. It's like 25 degrees almost. I'm so in the mood of spring. Although I've seen the weather channel and next week is going to be a bit freezing again, but never mind. My mindset is already on spring and spring weather and everything related to warmer days. So this thrift thing is going to be about that. What am I looking for today at the thrift store? I'm gonna look for fabrics, first of all, because I wanna find like very summery or springy fabrics that I can do maybe pants or blouses. I can do some tutorials for you guys. That will be great. I will also be with my eyes peeled off for pants like the one that I'm wearing today are the pants that I'm wearing today. They're so flowy. I just love them. It's a linen pant, very baggy or oversized kind of. It's the one that I thrifted, I think in my last thrifting video. I will also like to find not only long ones, but also like kind of Bermuda ones, or maybe I can cut them. I don't know. Let's see. I will also be looking for blouses and a kind of like light blouses or button downs with an statement with an, no, a, uh, a, with uh, maybe statement color, something kind of different, or even if it's more simple, something that I can thrift flip and do it more interesting. I will also be looking for skirts, mainly long skirts that I know I can style very easily and I can wear a lot during this season. And what else? I think that's it. Maybe I should get around also through the accessories, maybe some nice kitten heels. I say it every time and I never found it but maybe this time I'm the lucky one. Some handbags also and maybe some accessories. I'm actually loving a lot these like candy necklaces kind of thing and if I find any fun ones we'll for sure be thrifting them. And I think that's my thrifting bucket list for today so let's go thrifting. Okay, we are at Savers. I'm going to start with the fabrics. Let's see if I find any cute fabric to make any spring and summer garments. Let's see. All right, this one is not bad. This one we could make like a two set of top and pants. I see it, I'm really into the stripes. I just found this bed sheet in a light blue, but I think it's, it looks also very cute for a set. It's cotton, so I really like it. And I also found this other one in yellow. And I don't know what to do. This one has like, looks like they have washed it with another color. It's a bit stained here. I don't know what it is. Like, looks like black. I don't know, like a spray, it looks like. And I don't know, but I think this could be two very cute sets and this like baby colors. I really like them. I'm gonna hold on to them and I'll decide when I finish my thrifting. So I don't know if I want to take so many fabric, but 
I think I have to get advantage of it. Really cute. Look at this fabric, how cute. It's like a stripe, looks like an ice cream. I'm not gonna get it because this one is already $15. So yeah, but how cute this one. The shoes are not showing today. Wasn't having any luck in the accessories, but I just found these cute sunglasses. I don't know, I'm not really a fan of buying these like cheap sunglasses. The sun here is super strong, but maybe for an afternoon or yeah. So guys, let's start with the clothing. I'm going to start with the skirts. That is the thing that I have behind me. So yeah. Wish me luck! All right, I think I hit the, well, not the jackpot actually. Well, I think I got a bit lucky in the skirts because I'm not having any any luck actually. I found this one. I wanted to try it on because I'm not sure about the sizing, but it's a denim, black denim maxi skirt. So, yay! I'm in the pants now. I just found this one that I would love if it was my size and longer but these like cotton super cool for summer these are the ones that I'm looking so let's keep looking I found these ones, they're not that bad, it's more or less what I'm looking for, but they are cotton on and they're $13. I'm not paying $13 for this. Look at this old frame. Yeah, no, I'm sorry, but no. I'm gonna check now the shorts. Let's see if I find any Bermuda shorts. Not short shorts, no, I don't wear that. Just found this dress slash button down in a button up in one of the off racks and I think it's pretty cool like to wear it on the, on its own and on an ooh, and also with some pants underneath. I think it's very cute. Imagine over these super funky pants. I think it's a look. Okay, these shorts are cute, actually. I don't know. I see myself wearing this, but yeah. Just gonna hold on to it, and now I'll decide. These shorts are also cute in a gingham, but I'm not sure if I'm taking like too much prints today. I don't know what is happening the spring. Bye. 
I'm now checking the long sleeve shirts and why are they all polyester? Like having a lot of trouble to find anything, but let's keep looking. Just found two shirts. This one is 100% linen in a navy color, so love it. And this one is in a cotton, and yeah, as you can see, it's very bright pink. This one I'm 100% sure, but this one I will decide to check out. Look what I just found. This is the type of shirt that I'm after, but this one is 100% polyester, so I'm not gonna get it. Don't want to be smelly in it, but yeah, this is the kind of shirt that we're looking for. I found a shirt that I would normally not choose, but look at this with some like white or brown pants, and it's 100% cotton and it's made in Australia, so I think I'm gonna get it. I just had a look. Oh, very dark. I just had a look at the cardigans, I don't know why, but yeah, I wear cardigans all year long here in Melbourne, so yeah, but no luck in there. And you guys, I'm just gonna have a quick look at the tops, um, I don't think I have a lot of energy for the dresses today, I don't know, maybe I'll have a quick look also, I'll show you a little bit, but not really looking for any dresses, so yeah, let's see how we go. I never find any tops or almost never because they're just like, you know, piece of cotton fabric or polyester, you know, kind of like, yeah, kind of like this and I don't like them. So I'm always like skipping through so fast. Okay, I just found one with the tag on. It's cute. I don't know if I want to pay this though, but I know this is the type of top that I use a lot in spring and summer with imagine some jeans and loafers. This will be cute. So yeah, I'm just gonna hang on it. I have to say I love the teal color, but I wouldn't wear this so short. It's cool. Just found a cotton knit and I love the color. I think it's really cute. This one I'm gonna to get I'm gonna get it for sure. Yay, this one comes with me. Okay, you guys, I think I've checked everything. I just had a little browse, a fast browse actually on the dresses and nothing caught my attention. So I'm just gonna check everything that I have in my cart. It's quite a few things. I don't think I'm taking it all, but yeah, just gonna go through it and I'll decide and I'll show you when I get home. All right, I'm back. I'm gonna show you what I'm not taking and why. These ones, the string is already super worn out and the pants also, so not getting it. These ones are big for me and because they're short, I don't think they will look okay and don't really like how they sit. This pink shirt, although I love the color, I'm getting already a shirt today and I prefer the one that I'm getting than this one, so no. This dress slash shirt, I really like it, but it's a bit see-through and because it's white, it's a no for me. This t-shirt, I really like it, but it's $12 from Fada, so it's a no. 
and I'm not getting the sunglasses either. Let me show you this ones. Although I like how they look, I don't know if they have any UV protection or not, so I'm not gonna get them. I wanna burn my eyes. That's all. I'll show you when I get home what I buy. There's a lot of goodies today. Well, hello. Look who's back from the thrift store. I have to say, I can title this video like my spring super thrift or something like that. Let me just close the door. I don't know why I have it open. Well, yeah, because the temperature is great. All right, I'm gonna try to film this quickly because it's already 5.20. Look at this light, marvelous. I know there reaches one point in the day where I go really crazy and I start saying stupid and silly things. I don't know if this happens to anyone, but like since five until I have dinner, I'm just like, the Lulu. I think this is it, but I'm gonna try and keep it together. I'm going to start with the thrift haul. Okay, you guys, this is full till the maximum. And I'm going to leave the clothing for the end. I'm going to start with the fabrics that I bought today. I was pretty lucky. I really have to start working on my pile of fabrics. I have it just here. I have the fabrics that are already washed in this side and the ones that I haven't washed in the washing machine, you know, in like the cupboard of the washing machine. So I spent a total, I'm just gonna tell you like the total. I spent today $53 in total, the whole. So let's start with the fabrics. I bought two fabrics and a tablecloth. Let me show you first the tablecloth because I'm so excited because now that the good weather is here, we start always having our dinners outside in our little patio that we have. Like maybe we invite friends for a barbecue and so on. And we have this picnic table that's pretty ugly. It's just a simple one for, from Bunnings, but I love it because you can actually change the height and you can fold it. So I just have it stored next to my fridge. So I really like it, but it's ugly. So we need something to cover it. And I grew up in a household where we always used to have lunch and dinner, always with a table. We never had like only the table or individual mats. No, like my family was like always tablecloth. My parents have a wonderful collection from my grandmas and it's just beautiful. I always tell my mom like, I really want this collection for myself. I'm starting my collection. I haven't been in Spain, but now here also. Anyways, I found this beautiful tablecloth in a gingham in green that all the chairs that we have outside are green, so this matches perfectly. Not that it has to match, but I just love it. The fact that it's green. And I think, I have to measure it, but I think it's pretty much the same size as the table we have for outside. So really excited. And the price, you guys, let me see here, $4. Great, and it's actually a tablecloth, like it has the hems already done and everything. Love it. And then for fa fabrics, I found this striped fabric that there's a lot here. It has already been already cut, somebody didn't want anymore. It's in this, it's not really red, it's more like a raspberry kind of tone. I don't know, it's so beautiful. It's striped, I don't know, I thought it was super cute and there's a lot of fabric, so I can do like a two sets, something. I have in my Pinterest board um, these pants that I saw from the brand La Veste, that I love that brand. And yeah, I was thinking maybe I can do something like that, maybe a dress also, although a dress I don't think I will wear it that much, but imagine like a set of pants and a nice blouse for spring, yeah. I just loved it. There is a lot of fabric actually. And then I had two bed sheets that I found that they were super cute. One was in a light blue, this one here. And then I had also in my card a butter yellow one that I love. But before paying, like I always check everything like before I go to the counter just in case. And the yellow one had different stains. It looked like I saw a bit in my, when I first chose it, I show you in the video and it had like spray uh, stains and I thought they were only like located in one piece of the fabric so I was like it's okay I'll just cut that but when I opened it it was like all over the fabric so I wasn't sure that I was going to have a lot of fabric left was not worth it for me so I ended up buying only the baby blue 
I think this is a baby blue or a sky blue bed sheet. And with this one, I have a blouse saved on my Pinterest board. I will pop it up here. It's this blouse with like uh, some ties here. I think it will look very cute. Don't know yet how to or how I will tackle that. That will be one of my videos coming soon for sure oh yeah and the two the other two fabrics i'm gonna tell you the price so one was 550 and the other one was 450 and now let's start with the clothing let's start with the tops so this top was 650 it's yarn from italy although it's made in china but it's yarn from italy and it's 100 percent cotton and i chose it because i just love the color i always like my favorite color it's always like green blue and lilac and this one like this turquoise i thought it was super cute and imagine this a bit more like tan and with this color just looks so perfect love also the knitting i just thought it was so beautiful and this is the kind of shirts that is very difficult to find at the thrift stores i was telling you in my video that i never look at the tops or the tank tops or short sleeves because normally you have these basic t-shirts not really good quality i've been seeing a lot of shane lately and it's just like i just keep them like so fast i'm just even like only touching and if I found a linen or something like more nicer to the touch I'm like okay what is this and this one's one of them I got attracted by the color actually but I think it's so cute and also I love the fact that it's a uh, short sleeve sometimes here even if it's hot it gets old in just one second so having your shoulders covered really makes a difference good I find with this I know I can style it in many different ways I was thinking like I can style it easy way with just some jeans and some sneakers but also I could dress it up. I think this is a top that you can actually dress up a lot. I wear it with maybe a silk skirt or maybe with a blazer, like kind of like more dressier kind of style. I think it's just the perfect thrift to find. All right, the second top is this one that I thought it was so cute. I like the colors a lot. It has this pink, brown, beige, and white kind of tones going. And I just imagined this shirt with some beige pants or tan pants and loafers, like classic loafers. And I was just like, that's the outfit. This top was $7. I really gravitated more even to this shirt because here in the label, made in Australia, and 100% cotton. I don't know the brand, maybe someone who sees my video knows it. It's Sambelli Donna. Looks like an Italian brand, but then I saw here it was made in Italy. And I just love it. And it's in such a good condition. You guys, tell me what do you think about this? There's an ice cream. I'm going to see if I found it. There was an ice cream when I was growing up that it has that, like the exact same colors. And I think it's so cute. And the last top that I have, I still have three more items. The last top is is these 100% linen navy shirt you guys know how much i love my shirts i wear them a lot i wear them all year long even if they're linen i always wear them and i didn't have a navy color so i think this is a very good addition this is a bit of controversy but i love pairing navy with black and i just thought like this navy shirt with a black shirt skirt that i have and loafers i don't know why i keep telling like every single style with loafers but yeah i just thought it would look so good and this is like a staple uh, shirt that I needed in my wardrobe. Like I don't have a navy one and I know I'm just gonna use it like a lot. Great find also. Well, they're all great finds, that's why I bought them, but yeah. I don't know if I told you the price of the shirt. It was actually from Uniqlo, $11.80 but because of the discount, $9.43. When I saw the $12, I was like, is it a bit pricey or not? I had also a top from Zara that you see in my previous uh, clip while I was at the thrift store and I didn't get it because it was only like a simple sleeveless top and $12 from Zara. I wasn't going to pay that, but I think Uniqlo, at least the pieces that I have are better quality and I know this shirt will be my wardrobe forever. Now let's go with the bottoms that I bought today. I got a denim maxi skirt. I don't know how much I've manifested that. Finally, I found it. It's black. Never mind. I know I will, I will still style it a lot. So it's this one here. I just love it. It has these buttons at the front, but it doesn't open all the way down. So the buttons go 
until here. It's in denim, as I told you, color black. We love her, she's pretty. It was $9, originally from Uniqlo. It's a very light denim. I think I can wear it all year round. Like, I can wear it now as it is, and then in winter, if you pair it with some tights and boots, of course, you can also wear it. And I have so many different outfits that I could wear with this skirt. I'm so happy that I found it. I don't know how many times I've been manifesting of finding a maxi denim skirt. The one that I have is just below the knees and I'm always like, I need that extra fabric. And I found it. Works with any kind of look that I want. I can show you here some inspirations that I have thought with this skirt you guys tell me do you have a denim skirt and if you do what color is it is it like washed or is it like more in the darker side really like the shape i really like the fit i tried it on on top of my pants i have to say the ones that i'm wearing today but they're very thin and i thought it looked very cute so happy with this find super super happy and then the last three find of today you know i normally go for like neutral colors i'm always like beige black and sometimes a pop of colors but i never really buy prints unless it's like a gingham that i learn how to style it these pants i really like them they really caught my eye and i was just like i know if i leave them i will regret it for sure so i, I had to get them and i'm gonna show you these are the pants i just love the colors i thought they were like so cute when i saw them i was already thinking of how i could style them because i really wanted to get them if i'm not sure about an outfit i have this rule that i have to at least put five outfits together before i buy them i saw these pants and i was like okay let me think of those outfits and yeah you guys we won my favorite color here, I think it's, well, apart from the blue, but it's also the butter yellow that I was telling you before that I couldn't get from the bed sheets. So it has it here. And they're just so funky and so cool. And I know you guys, these ones are going to be one of my staple pieces. I know you're going to see me a lot with these pants. I think they're so fun. I don't have any pants this time. And I thought it was a great addition for my wardrobe. Just trying to like, spice well not spice it up but like make it more fun now that we're heading into like warmer weather warmer weather i thought it looked great also how i'm dressed today with like white tee and just a handmade piece on top and the pants i thought they just looked great and the pants were seven dollars also so great what do you think of other pants they are my clowny pants but i love them that's all for today guys hope you have enjoyed this video if you have so don't forget to give me a thumbs up and don't forget also to subscribe to my channel because i see there are people that are coming back every single week and they're still not subscribed so please subscribe to my channel so you don't miss my videos hope you guys have a wonderful day and see you in the next one bye